I always say, I notice details. So, my mother literally mimicked her mother. How? How you say? Okay. My uncle Jimmy and my uncle Archie had the same father and the same mother. The same as my brother Terry and my brother Jack have the same father. And the same mother. But my mother. And her sister. Have different fathers. The same. As my sister Tiffany. And my sister Marquita. Have different fathers. But the same mother. Just like my mom and my auntie. So. That's why I say that's a part of the generational curse too. I have every intention of having. All of my kids. With the same person. Because I think that's a big part of why. Me and my siblings don't get along. Having different fathers. And the same mother. And it also shows. How my mother thinks that women. Are more important than men. Because in her mind. As long as we all have the same mother. We should all get along when wrong. On top of us all being different zodiac signs. So you know. And I, I truly believe this. That my oldest siblings, Jack, Terry, and Marquita, have an old, outdated version of my mother that they like to cling to that doesn't fucking exist anymore. She not the same. And they just, they just refuse to believe that she ever changed when she did. And she changed for the worse, is what they don't get. So, my sister Marquita got married, and she moved out the house. And in her mind, she, she got... She stayed in the loop, but no, she didn't. It's a lot of fucking gaps in her timeline. Same goes for my brothers. Now, one of my brothers, he wasn't even locked the fuck up. He's just that type of brother where he shows up once out of every blue moon. But point is, the three older siblings don't know what the fuck is going on. But they'll argue with me like they know what the fuck is going on when it comes to fact checking. It's like, no, you're not acknowledging that you got gaps in your timeline. When you do. When you were out having babies and shit. And, and trying to have a happy marriage. Even though, you know, my sisters actually rather succeed more so than my brother when it comes to having a happy marriage. Makes perfect sense to me knowing what the personality differences are. You know. So, that's a simple ass generational curse to break. And it's not just on my mama's side. With my father... Him and my Uncle Clarence always got favored. But my Auntie Geneva and my Uncle Burrell got disrespected. Now, my Auntie Geneva passed away, unfortunately. But my Uncle Burrell is still living. But my father doesn't talk to him at all. It's like he doesn't have a younger brother. Because he favors my Uncle Clarence. So, it's like it's a generational curse on both sides of the family. That's a problem on my mama's side and on my father's side. And they all just ignore it. Like, no, everything's perfect. Everything's fine. Let's just brush it under the rug. And no, I ain't going to do that shit. Because I don't want my kids to be uh, having no fucking sibling rivalries like my older siblings have with me. And I'm saying it that way because I'm not in competition with my brothers and my sisters. But they're always in competition with me. It's real fucking sad because I go through that already with a girlfriend. Where it's like... How you love me, but you competing with me. And why are you competing with me when you claim you're doing better than me? So it's just, it's fucking weird, the shit y'all be doing, man. And it, it's sad because I thought I was going to get a break. I've been single since 2016. But it seemed like as soon as I get rid of all the crazy hoes I was dating, here come my mama and my sisters trying to be the uh, the crazy people in my life. Where it's like, that's the shit that pisses me off. That you can do things that can negatively affect my livelihood when I can't do anything to fuck up your life. That's not fair. Now, if I could come to your house and fuck shit up for you, then, hey, we doing it to each other, but that ain't the case. 